Hey everybody, it's Tiffany and Arlen, the Patio Gardeners, and we're here at our community garden plot, and uh, Tiffany noticed something that uh, some people may not have seen before. So, Tiffany, what in the world is this? Right oh, here. you pointed it out. I was going to oh, ask people shucks. if they could figure it out, but oh, no. it kind of stands out. So, we were here looking to see if there were any tomatoes harvest, and I noticed something a little bit weird and realized we have a special pest visitor. Yeah. It is, um, this is a common guy that you see on tomatoes. They're called tomato horn worms. And what they are, are a caterpillar that is uh, laid by a moth, and they usually lay them on the underside of the leaves. And then they come out, and when they're in this caterpillar stage is when they do the most damage, which is to basically destroy your garden. So they're going to eat your tomato plants, right? Yeah, yeah, and other plants as well. So whenever you find them, you want to kill them. <laughs> uh, you want to drown them. Uh, some people feed them to their chickens if they have chickens. And you can cut them in half with some garden shears, but you want to kill them. Um, unless your guy looks like this. Because you'll you probably notice that he has all these little white things on there. So normally it would just be green, right? Without the white. Yeah, normally they're green. You can identify them because they have these kind of V-shaped stripes on them. And then that little horny, that horn tail on the back. And that's his, his head is, is, is this uh, front part here. Um, but this guy has all these little white things on them. And these are actually wasp eggs. The so, larvae or whatever, yeah. Well, I think these are just... Oh, like, no, it's before, yeah. They're just eggs right now. Sure. So a wasp lays their eggs on the hornworm, and then what happens is that when these hatch, they're going to eat them. They're going to eat the worm. Yep. So these wasps are actually beneficial. So we don't want to kill the hornworm because if we kill the hornworm, it'll kill these little larvae. We want to we want to keep them. So what we're actually going to do when we're done filming this video is we're going to clip this little branch off. We're going to take him off into the park away from the community garden so that these nobody guys, else will be infected. infected yeah so he yeah. won't hurt our plant won't hurt any of our neighbors and then they will eat him alive eventually <laughs> um but otherwise drown him cut him in half um but you just want to get them away from your garden don't just throw them in the yard you want to normally kill them okay but i mean that's that's what it is these guys are super creepy super gross and usually if you have one you have more we haven't seen any yet but we're going to keep our eyes out for them yeah and definitely get rid of any others if we find them yeah so i guess that's what to do if you find one of these guys on the underside of one of your tomato plants yeah he's so gross <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, well listen, thanks for watching everybody. Uh, we do post other tutorials and other types of videos. If you want to subscribe to us, go ahead and do that. Uh, if not, thanks for watching. Alrighty, we'll see you next week. Say bye! bye.